Welcome back. Do you have any dinner plans? Sandwiches, pastas, steak, no matter what you are craving. There are a few restaurants that you should eat at before the night's over tonight. The annual Dine to Donate event is today, and it helps raise money for the Children's Miracle Network. Restaurants participating include Noodles and Company, Old Chicago, Usher's House, and Lone Star Steakhouse. Money raised will help fund special programs, research, and buy state-of-the-art equipment. Last year, they raised more than $6,000. Dine to Donate will be going on until the restaurants close tonight. Some words for the day from Dr. Seuss. The more that you read, the more things you know. The more that you learn, the more places you'll go. Those words are more than appropriate as some young men, most uh, certainly on the go, are sharing their reading skills and underlining the importance of reading to a captivated audience. The young men are members of the Fargo Force hockey team and their audience are first graders over at Bellet El Bennett Elementary School. Robbie Baydoun is from Michigan and Hugo Reinhardt is from Sweden as these 19-year-olds ride the bus from town to town for their next hockey game. They're preparing for the future. Well, they're preparing for their college educations as well. They're reading. I like to read books on like sports psychology. I'm pretty interested in that stuff, so I read a lot of stuff on that. I don't know if you read. Yeah, I try to read some. I try to study for the SAT for to be able to go to college. But it wasn't all a lecture about the importance of reading. They shared with the first graders a bit about playing hockey for the force and their lives. Doing so, and Reinhardt offered a mini lesson in the native tongues of Swedish. Mm. Yeah. Well, stick around. Alex is at the Twins Caravan, and he'll bring us the very latest right after the break.